Hi, I'm Stephanie Wagner, and I'm with TaxFile, a company that works as a resource to CPA and accounting firms around the country. I'm a member of the Cal CPA Orange County YDP Committee, and if you're interested in joining, please click the link above, subscribe to our channel, and reach out to request more information. Today, I want to talk about the importance of promoting yourself digitally. As a new career professional, your job not only to learn the crafts of your trade, but also to help promote your company and probably eventually even acquire some new clients. Aside from that, you may want to grow to become a thought leader in your industry and eventually maybe even market your own firm down the road. Let's start with getting your brand out there. The number one goal of digital promotion is visibility. People are starting to ignore the hefty written articles and content because as we've seen, especially recently, there just seems to be an oversaturation of information on social media. You have to find a way to have your own name and brand stand out amongst all of that. But what does that even mean? Well, let's think creatively. What are some options to stand out that others may be too nervous to do? Whether it's podcasts, videos, a daily thought post, just find a way to separate yourself from the pack. Let's think about what industry influencers do differently. I can tell you can already think of the top two people you like to read on your newsfeed. You can probably picture them pretty immediately. They're the people you never skim right by, you always look forward to their posts, and you read them in entirety. I'm willing to bet there's a few things that they do differently than most everybody else. One, their content is usually visual, not just written. That's more than just a stock photo accompanied by a huge article. Their posts may be them talking on video or an infographic with data backing their point, and it has something directly relevant to do with what they're talking about. It's tapping into two different ways that the human brain actually learns. Two, their thoughts are not just status quo. They're not the people worried about ruffling feathers. Whether or not everyone agrees with their opinions, their goal and what they're getting is the engagement levels of people commenting, responding, maybe even disagreeing. They are initiating conversations around their topics, which means they are now showing up on other news feeds, which then exponentially increases their visibility. You probably know what they do and what the company that they represent does, even if it has absolutely no relation to you. Whether or not you even need their particular service, I'm willing to bet that they're top of mind when someone asks if you know someone in their field. This is brand recognition. This is the golden nugget if there ever was one. This is what you're striving for and you're more likely to get referrals because now your messaging has resonated with people in and outside of your industry. Finally, I encourage you to push yourself to do one thing outside of your comfort zone every day that you specifically believe will further your business. Someone told me that very early in my career and it has stuck with me ever since. There are so many people out there that understand these concepts. They're not rocket science, but very few that are actually willing to try something that makes them a little uncomfortable. Go ahead, make that video, post an idea that you know not everyone will agree with. This is free marketing. And guess what? Free marketing is still marketing. As you grow in your career, you're going to see how important it is to a business's success to take advantage of every opportunity. Become an industry name, and not only will you find career success, we will have others knocking down your door for the opportunity to work with you. Good luck, and we hope to see you all at future events.